So drawing on your unique experience and from a private equity standpoint of an investor, a board member running businesses for private equity and now being a senior operating partner, what advice could you give to a business owner who is thinking about exiting their business and possibly selling to a private equity firm? Um, I think there are two things you need. I think the two things that you need to put in front of just price. And, and the very first thing is, you know, what's your goal? What do you as a seller, what, what do you want out of this? Mm -hmm. If all you want to do is, you know, liquidate your position and, you know, move to Bimini, <laughs> uh, well, then it probably defaults to just price. If there's something else that you want out of this, you want to continue in the business, uh, you want the business to um, grow and flourish and provide employment, then you, know, you, might, you might have some you know, soft side goals that you want. But whatever those are, you need to get them prioritized in your own head and have that discussion with, with the people that you're selling to. So whatever those goals are, um, I think the next thing is you need to be comfortable with the personnel. If you're going to stay with the business, you really need to be comfortable with the personnel that you're going to be working with. You know, do you feel like the people at the private equity firm, do you feel like they're honest? Do you feel like they have, you know, your interests at heart? You know, so when they say, oh, yeah, we have shared goals, is that what they mean? Or are they just saying that, you know, to get the deal done? Yeah. So, you know, that that's a critical part because you're going to be family for six to eight years. So you don't want to be family. You don't want to walk in and have in-laws that are, you know, <laughs> at odds Outlaws. with you all the time. That, that's not a pleasant situation. Yeah. And for most business owners, this is going to happen once in their career, once in their lifetime. For a very select few, it may happen multiple times if they partner with private equity. But if it's going to happen once, you want to ensure that not only your, your hard goals, but your soft goals are one met, achieved and aligned with your potential partner. I, and I, I actually, I would say aligned is probably more important than anything else, right? If, if you, sometimes you can't guarantee that they'll be met. You can plan on it, can't guarantee it, but you can certainly guarantee alignment from the get go.